Hi there, welcome back. I'm Dan from Balls with Skirmish. This is the final episode in our short series of how to improve your woods ball play using old school woodland tournament techniques. Last thing we're going to show you here is a technique called snap shooting. Okay, and now let's assume you've got into a barricade here. Okay, I've had a little look out from down this area here and I've looked over there and the first thing I see is Matt posted up on me. One of the enemy has got their gun posted up. Now they are in what's called a gun up position. They're shooting uh, around where I've just stuck my head out of my barricade just here and he's not putting his head down and I know if I come out there I'm going to get blown away every time. Here's the trick. I change my position, okay, and when snap shooting it's always worth noting the more solid the core the better your snap shot's going to be. You don't want to be leaning right out when you snap out you may well fall over. It sounds weird, it happens to all of us. And what I'm going to do here so that guy, he's posted up shooting there. I'm going to come up here, okay, and from this position. Now you'll notice here, this elbow tucks in nicely, okay. Last thing I want is this sticking out here. Now, that's a natural shooting position for most players, but you want to pull that down, okay, so it's tucked in nicely there, okay. By tucking it in nicely, there's nothing sticking out. And then from here, okay, I'm in a nice position. My gun's there ready and waiting to go. Now, if I'm not entirely certain where he is, without bringing the gun out, I can just have a little look around, shuffle around, no, not quite there. There he is there. So, I've now got a mental position, I know where he is, and I'm gonna flip out, snap out, take the shot, and eliminate the player. Remember, if in doubt, aim that little bit higher, as we discussed earlier, okay, but when you snap, maximum of two shots and back in. Now, he's at the moment posted up down there but it only takes a brief moment for him to change his position and start firing at me here. So, I know he's there, okay, I'm ready, I snap out, and I've just put two straight on him. If you wanna go around there, you'll see that one, nice and straightforward. Hopefully the player is now eliminated. Now, when you shoot, okay, trick is, get straight back in. You may not hit him first time. If you don't hit them first time, make sure you come back in and you're safe. At this range here, I'm able to know that I've eliminated him, okay, but don't hang out for too long, straight back in. You may well have teammates there, they're ready and waiting to take you on as soon as they sit. Okay, so, you're here now in behind us, we know we've got our player over there, he is posted up on this area here, I've got a brief moment to come up, okay, and then snap him out, so I'm here, have a quick look, there he is there, okay, this elbow gets tucked in nicely, and then all I'm going to do is snap out, eliminate him, and get straight back in. There we go. Straight back in, always. Never hang out, never leave anything exposed. Keep that elbow in. Okay, and then we can have a quick look. You'll see the judge going in and removing the player, or the player walking off. One of your teammates will let you know, but that's what you want to do. It's a bit tricky, but that's a little bit advanced, but you will get the hang of it. 